Um, there's a similar result with psilocybin and the game of pool, pocket billiards. Right. You, you have more feel and you, you know where the ball is going more. Right. It's a, it's right. And you can understand angles and right. patterns. Yeah, absolutely. Absolutely. And I think sports, I mean, like Joe, Barbara Bachelor, he loved cricket. And he said he was a better bowler. Have you heard of the, the, uh, the pitcher who pitched a game on acid, a no, no hitter game on acid? No. Yeah. Who, who was that again, Jamie? It's a very famous story of a guy who uh, he made a mistake yeah. and got just too high. He was, yeah. And it didn't wear off, and he went to the game. Here it is, Doc yeah. Ellis. Yeah. He took acid and pitched a no-hitter. Yeah. So, like, don't <laughs> get his ball yeah. when he was yeah. on acid, yeah. which is, sounds well, that, so that, crazy. That's exactly it. I yeah. mean, and do you know that picture of the spider, which came out in the 60s? Um, the spider's web. Yes. Um, I'm, yes. I'm trying to recreate that study. It, See if you Oxford. find that spider. They yeah. gave the spider LSD. Yeah. 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 And, um, you know, the caffeine one was absolutely chaotic. It right. was so bad. Look at it. Uh, the cannabis one started off rather well, then you're chaotic, just like cannabis does happen. But look at the LSD one. And the one. LSD one was perfect. Better than perfect. Well, look at the normal one, though. The normal one's pretty amazing, too. Yeah. But funny enough, now I know the leading web person in the world is a uh, is a um, don at oxford who i've been talking about six years now to do this research but you wouldn't believe it to give a spider lsd one has to get ethical approval oh that's hilarious <laughs> i mean that's you know, funny and for eight six eight years we haven't yet got the ethical approval there's nothing ethical about being a spider yeah, i know you can't <laughs> believe it <laughs> Their whole existing yeah. it's, it's existence yeah. is unethical. Yeah. <laughs> they're, they're trapping other insects. Exactly. Yeah. exactly. Anyway, so, so far we haven't done it, but I really want to do it this year. Mm. Because, I mean, maybe they were pulling our legs. But it's a, it's a very interesting concept. Sure. That even at the spider level, it improves function. Yes. Um, it would make sense that caffeine would be all over the place too. Yeah. The heart rate would be jacked up, yeah. be, or whatever their central nervous system. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But it's very. There's so much we could do, and that's why I I actually feel having lived with these substances as my passion my passion for fifty or sixty years, and particularly LSD because I think it's the cleanest and I know it the best. I've got a very good instinct how to do it. I've I've designed several studies I haven't talked about because I don't, they shouldn't come out, but I can see how it can help, like the old woman with Alzheimer's. Mm. Which I'd like to just show you, not to go on the sure. thing, but to show you. Yes. Because the difference is so big. When I showed it to the professor of geriatrics in Switzerland, within an hour he said he wanted to do collaboration with me to do an Alzheimer's study mm. with it because you can't fake someone's expression. So from deep apathy, it goes to a sparkling little old lady. And there's 